Daniil Medvedev defeated world number one Janik Sinner in five sets on Tuesday to reach a second successive Wimbledon semi-final, subduing the gallant challenge of the Italian, who suffered a worrying mid-match health scare. The fifth-ranked Medvedev triumphed 6-7, 7 ninths, 6-4, 7-6, 7 quarters, 2-6, 6-3 to, to avenge his Australian Open final loss to Sinner in January. His four-hour victory also ended a five-match losing streak against the Italian as Medvedev reached his ninth Grand Slam semifinal. The 28-year-old former U.S. Open winner will face either defending champion Carlos Alcaraz or Tommy Paul of the United States for a place in Sunday's final. In a tight first set in which neither man gave up a break point, Medvedev edged ahead in the tie break on the back of a lung-busting 33-shot rally. However, he squandered a set point and his game suddenly fell apart, serving up a double fault as Sinner pocketed the opener. The mercurial Russian carved out the only break of the second set in the third game on his way to leveling the quarterfinal. Sinner slipped another break down a 2-1 in the third set and immediately summoned the tournament physio. The Italian, appearing distressed, had his blood pressure taken courtside before he left for a medical timeout. After a 10-minute delay, the 22-year-old resumed play and thrilled the center court crowd when he bravely clawed his way back to 5-5. He then wasted two set points which allowed Medvedev to sweep through the tie break. However, the Italian was undaunted and leveled the quarterfinal on the back of breaks in the third and fifth games of the fourth set. But it was Medvedev finished the fresher of the two players, breaking in the final set on his way to victory.